So in this video we're going to take you through the process of setting up your MailChimp account and that's the first stage in the process of getting your email newsletter off the ground. So first of all you need to go to MailChimp.com and you will see the home page uh, which looks like this. So first of all you will need to uh, sign up so you can click on the sign up for free button or the sign up button on the top right. And the first stage in the process is it will ask you for some key information uh, that will they will need to um, set up your account. So um, basically, um, they'll need your email address. So I'm just going to put my email address in, in here. And I'm going to make my username the same as my email address to keep things simple, but you can do whatever you need to do. And I'm going to put in my password in there and create my account. So the first thing is that that is going to send an email to my uh, email account just to verify who I am. So I need to go into my email. So I just open up my email here. Hopefully it's come through. Yep, there it is. I'm just going to open up my MailChimp email and click activate my account. Now it needs to confirm that I am who I say I am and I'm not a robot just trying to set up a dummy account. So I'm going to go through this capture process. Hopefully I got those others right. Yes, I did. Okay, and now I can actually log into my account uh, using my username and password that I just set up. So that was actually slightly different. I'm going to retype that. And my password. And then I'm going to log in. Okay, so once you've set up your username and password, which is what we've just done, uh, you will then need to add some more information just to get your account set up. Um, so first of all, I'm going to have to enter my name. It's got my email address there already. And my company name. I need to set up my URL. And I also need to provide my physical address. Now, the reason why uh, they do this is because you do need to have a physical address printed on your email newsletter. So whatever address you put in here will go on your email newsletter, but obviously you will have the chance to change that. Okay, and just select the right country as well. Again, this is quite important because it actually ties up to your time zone, which it's going to ask me for in a moment. So when you set up your emails in the future, you can actually schedule them to go at a certain time um, and that will be according to whatever time zone you put in here. I'm just going to put in my industry as well, which is quite health helpful because um, uh, when you actually send out uh, newsletters, you have access to reports and it can show me against industry standards what um, my open rate is compared to other kind of standard industry open rates. So I can just see how well I'm performing against the, the kind of norm for my industry. And then I'm going to select a GMT somewhere on this long list. There it is. Okay, and I'm not going to subscribe to the MailChimp emails. There we go. Saving and getting started. And that's it, you have created your MailChimp account. So the next step is to actually create your first list and add some contacts.